Hello, beautiful sacred souls. Today, I want to talk about owning your value and owning your worth, honoring your healing, honoring your love, honoring your connection to the divine, and the price that we put on our healing, the price that we put on our love lives, the price that we put on our connection to all that is in this universe. This idea of money is one of the scariest topics that so many of us don't want to talk about. As a coach, the number one message thing that I hear is, oh, that sounds great. I want to sign up, but I don't have the money. I don't have the finances. Oh, I can't afford it. Yet the same price that someone is willing to pay for a skirt, food, a night out. People aren't willing to pay for their healing, for their love, for their spirituality. Our money is energy. Everything in this world is energy. And the question is, how are you valuing the things that you purchase? How are you valuing the things that you buy? Because the reason that we buy anything in this world is because we value it. I spend most of my money on food because I value food, because I love to eat. I value it, so I spend my money on it. I can spend $100 out to eat, but to spend $100 in a coaching car, that's when we become uncomfortable. Because we're not valuing ourselves. We're not valuing our own worth. And if we don't start to invest in ourselves, if we don't start to invest in our healing, in our love, in our connection to the many realms of spirit, then what are we investing in? One of the hardest things is finding our worth and finding our value and asking ourselves, what is it worth? So I want to just encourage each and every one of you guys to ask yourself how much worth and how much value do you reflect back at yourself? How much are you worth? What is your value? How much is it worth to let go of your biggest trauma, to heal your biggest wound? What is finding the love of your life, your soulmate, your divine partner? What is that worth? What is your enlightenment worth? If it's worth nothing, then you won't have the love. You won't have the connection to spirituality. You won't have the healing. But if it's worth all of the money in the world, then you'd pay a million dollars to heal your greatest trauma. You'd pay a million dollars to find the love of your life. You'd pay a million dollars to become enlightened and to have all the secrets of the universe. Yet so often I heal, I can't afford. I can't afford coaching. But you can afford popcorn. You can afford to go out to eat. You can afford to buy that outfit. You invest in a gym membership. You invest in your health. But what I coach, what I teach is health. It's emotional health. It's spiritual health. When we are in line with our value, our sense of service rises. And I'll give you an example of this. I did two weddings. I'm a wedding planner. And I did two weddings um, this year. And my prices, I'm going to be honest, my prices for coaching, my prices for wedding planning are not cheap. Um, it's roughly about $150, $200 an hour that I charge. And I did two weddings this year out of 14 or so that I had and two weddings weren't happy 
And the two weddings that weren't happy with the service that I performed was the two weddings that I gave a discount on. My normal pricing for my weddings are like $1,900. I gave a discount of $800, $1,100 off. They received a wedding service for $800. That's normally $1,900. And they were unhappy with the service that I performed, which made me reflect what was wrong with my service. And why is it that someone that pays $1,900 for my service loves me, writes me so many reviews, tells me how great I did. But someone who got it for $800 wasn't happy with my service. Reason being is whether I consciously recognized it or not, when I performed that wedding, when I performed that service, I probably wasn't feeling like my value and my worth was being seen because I was getting paid much less than what I valued myself at. By giving a huge discount, I was lowering my worth. And so my performance went down. And the truth is, when we align our value, our service will rise. Owning a value is growth. It's self-love. It's self-compassion. So with all this being said, I leave you with the thought and the feeling of how much is your healing worth? How much is your love worth? How much is finding your soulmate worth? How much is reaching enlightenment worth? How much is overcoming your sexual trauma of rape or molestation worth? How much is feminine empowerment worth? You decide. And if you feel that it is worth hundred dollars for a coaching session reach out and allow me to be your coach and let's set up a three-month coaching package until next time I love you